Yeah, mate. Uh, let's have a look here. A very quick look. Uh, it's pretty important. Would you say it's do or day time? It is do or day time. Um, oh, too similar again. Yeah, I don't really recover. Yeah, uh, like a lot of times you can see here, you got one bounce, and and basically that was it. It was down. Um, this had a bounce, but it flipped green again, and this just keep keep uh, kept crashing down. Let's just look back here. See, this was um, is a three month chart, but yeah, Black Monday here. You can see back here 1973 there was one bounce and then it kept going um, there is no data on this chart we need to go to the Dow I think for uh, they've updated their chart actually it's a lot better than it used to be um, but uh, there was one bounce here and then it, once it kept going you know you're, you're away and see here see the whole way it's stuck underneath the moving average as well back in the, in the, in the Great Depression uh, I suppose here as well there's one bounce and roll over again but um yeah, uh, you're you're dead right. Um, is it do or day time? It, it basically basically much is. Uh, how much can, can the money printing actually save the stock market as well? I mean, I highly doubt it. But there is a bearish monthly stop hunt here. Sorry, bearish three month stop hunt, and we are uh, what is that? Seven days away from a new quarter, right? The, the, the likely outcome at the moment is that there will be some sort of bounce up here and, and probably reject then and flip red. If we re flip red and come back down to these lows, well, the likelihood is going to break through them lows and come on down. Where is it going to come on to? I, I, I'm not too sure yet. Um, different charts uh, indicate that we're coming back to fill the, the COVID uh, uh, breakdown. Um, Sorry, uh, let's just look here. I forget what. Yeah, see this wick here, right? Uh, I did draw it right. You know that that wick will likely need filled. We didn't fill the wick here, right? That was a huge wick, but mm, slightly different. Slightly, slightly different. It's above all moving averages. Your big breakup consolidation. Um, but anyway, this wick is giant, right? At some point, we should fill that wick. So it, it would, to me, it would appear at the moment that the market is headed here right down there to the 2800 level uh, right down to fill that somewhere in, in that ballpark um, this is a bear basically a bearish pattern you know you've got your, your your rejection here well there's an argument here that this stop on th that the market is technically a little bit bullish above this line if we break below this line well it's it's game on the bears are in full control at that point any breakdown as soon as we break below here the move will be sharp and fast probably down into, into this level here um, at this point you can see it's holding because of the stop hunt there was there was buyers below this low and held it up you know but if this low breaks again uh, the bears sorry the bulls will uh, g give up and, and and the market will roll over pretty fast you can kind of see here in the, in the volume profile um, well I mean it's down actually below here are, are we gonna do something like like this and take out this low and maybe hold you know before we're going back up like build out a longer base now that i know that this base i drew a huge 10-year base or 15-year base i didn't really mean to do that but if you, if you look at the base here you know it is 2000 here and obviously 2009 there uh before well before when you move back up to the top of the base you know it's a it's a it's a 12-year base basically until you get back to the peak so that is 12 years so when i say 15 years it may not be too crazy to be saying it's a 15 year base of course that's just pure speculation at the moment but um yeah i, I agree with you it's do or die time i mean if this new candle flips red right you you, you do not oh you, you want to be taking way less risk in the market you want to be protecting yourself bitcoin can easily drop if uh, if we have a red flush in the market as well bitcoin could roll over again if this flips red, yeah, definitely need to be more careful in the market, all markets. So, you know, we, we need to be reactive uh, in the moment, but uh, definitely need to be prepared for it.